Oh. Bye bye. Wait, did my did my camera stop working? Oh my goodness! I swear. If I had money, <laughs> just you coming by and saying hi is all that matters. But it's like my chat trying to take off their clothes because they want to fucking do weird things to me all this damn time. There we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, as you can tell, that first boss is pretty self-explanatory. So I absolutely fucking just love the noise Toon Link makes whenever they touch fire. He's like, yeah, chat! Well, Prince Kamali, don't you have something you want to say? Um, I heard everything from Medley. Chat, thank you so much. I'm sorry I mistrusted you. Hope I can be like you someday, chat. No, you do not want to be like my chat. Why can't I get on the boat? Huh? Hey. Got the part in the boat. That's got under our own trees. Really? I have to put the fucking music first? Ugh, oh, God. Why am I like this? Yes, do not see what rises up from the horizon? That is where you must go, chat. Forest Haven. Hell yeah, my favorite music in the game. I must apologize. I was in error. I saw your clothing and suddenly I felt a longing for an age gone by. A lot thing caused the ancient time to pass my lips. And the guardian spirit of this forest haven, the Deku Tree. I owe you my thanks for your aid in writing me of those- of ridding me of those failed creatures. Okay, yeah, so we're gonna be getting the Deku Oh, what are you calling yourself? Chat? Oh, well, it's him talking, whoops. Oh, then, chat, these are the Korok, the spirits of the forest. Once upon a time, long ago, the Korok took on human forms. But when they came to live on the sea, they took these shapes. Now they fear people. To me, they will ever be my cherished little children. As it happened, you have come just in time for a ceremony that the Koroks hold, but once every year, it's about to begin. To grant the pearl to you once your ceremony is complete, Apologize for the brief delay, but if the ceremony is not complete soon, ill fate could befall us. So let it begin. Are you ready, my children? We know, oh, great Deku Tree, something terrible has happened. It is Makar! Makar! What is the matter, Winder? You and Makar are always late. No, not that, oh, great Deku Tree. Makar fell into the Forbidden Woods! What? The Forbidden Woods? So now we can uh, either use it like a Gust of wind, or we can fly. Please, you must fly from over there to here using your deck leaf. What if I don't fucking want to? Like, have you thought about that? I'm not going to yet. Ow. Great. Fun. Now, Link. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Is this Golden Age Simpsons? Because I'm about to murder a kid. Compass, how fucking useful. I genuinely think as Zelda went from 2D to 3D, compasses just got, like, compass and dungeon maps just got more and more useless. It's a moth! Oh, I missed! 
Come on. Come down. There we go. Boomerang! In this game, the boomerang's actually useful. Oh, wait! Actually! Ooh! You guys want to see something? Okay, wait. You just saw that. You guys want to see something? You guys want to see something? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, but I have to go back to the fucking Deku tree. Ah! Oh. Damn. Okay, never mind. Fuck it. I'm not going to do that. It's going to take too long. I'll tell you what's the note, boss. You love my car? I love my car. Damn it. I tried to jump out. I tried to size up out. <laughs> Ow. It's fine. Literally in the time it would have taken me to go get the spring water, like, I could kill him at least two more times. It's a very easy boss fight. But yeah, if you have the spring water from the Deku- Oh, look! Uh, if you have the spring water from uh, the Deku tree and you just pour it onto that thing, it instantly kills it. Making it one of the more safer bosses to beat damage wise. Swordsman, are you the one who rescued me? You have my thanks. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on Earth was over. But. Why are you here, Swordsman? What? The Great Deku Tree sent you? Oh, that's right. This is the day of our annual ceremony. Oh, I'm in trouble. I shouldn't be here. I must get out of here immediately. Mm. Oh, Makar, you have returned safely. Sorry, mm. Great Deku Tree. I know you warned us many times, but still, I did not listen. Mm. Do not worry, Makar. You are safe now. Be more careful from now on. You have done well, chat. I must thank you for your brief. Here's that which I have promised. Use it. You have received, however you pronounce that name's purple. The Earth Spirit, the Deku Tree, has seen fit to give you this jewel. Treasure of the Goddess. I don't fucking know. It is my hope that this pro shall lead you to, your, to a fair destiny. All is well, Makar. Do not cry. Please, play your song for me as you always do. Oh, that's right! We must begin our ceremony soon before the day ends! Try to keep you all waiting. Let the ceremony begin! Makar is the best way he is. A great chat. It's my thanks to you. I shall play even harder than I normally do. Hope you enjoy it. My favorite part. Siri, I've once again produced some what? Wording? But these seeds will continue to spread new forests across the great sea. Let us go, Korox, to the sea! See you all next year! Take care! Farewell, great swordsman. May the winds of chance bring us together again someday. They're stealing all the bombs! Look, don't be mad at us. It's not our fault that we absolutely gotta have bombs to get the treasure we're after. How about you just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly we've been running here, yeah? <laughs> I bet you're thinking it was foolhardy to ask Paris to pay such an outrageous price, huh? Yep, I bet you are. You know, Gonzo, I still can't get over that bit of fast talking pulled to get the information out of the postman. Huh? Oh yeah, that was smooth. I tell you, the minute I set my eyes on that chat, I just knew he was hiding something back at outset. Yeah. When I saw that postman, I kind of like I was all worried about the kid and stuff. I 
Nice though, he spills the beans. Good work, Gonzo, really. Just top knock. It's funny though. I'm thinking this is maybe the first time sh you've sh shown such wit. She's cunning. You know, with her cunning and Miss Tetra smarts, you got married and. Oh, shut up. Now! You idiot, keep your mouth shut. Yeah, I don't. Like, whatever. What? Miss Tetra, are you listening to this nitwit? Can't you dock him some pay or something? Quit go goofing off, both of you. Keep your childish jokes to yourselves and get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading them up, we're setting, we're setting sail for outside island. Ah. What? Yes, we have to leave immediately? It's been so long since we were on shore. We need to fill our bellies with some good eating, yeah? How about we grow up tonight and shove off tomorrow morning instead? I mean, uh, I'm fine either way, of course. Whatever you say is fine, miss, is what I meant to say. It's just that the boys are so excited to come to town, yeah? And I can't help but think it would be awfully hard on them to leave so soon without a proper layoff. So, what say we sell set sail tomorrow, yeah? What do you say, miss? That treasure isn't going anywhere. You're with me, right, boys? It was for a night of fun. <laughs> You're all fools, do you know that? You saw the demolished island? You saw the senseless destruction? We have to hurry on to outset or the same thing could happen there. Huh? Try to be disrespectful, but I have some of the things you're worried more about the island than the treasure, miss. Don't be ridiculous. I want, you know, treasure. Alright, fine. Have it your way. Leave the town tomorrow, you big babies. We're setting sail at first light. No sleeping in, understood? <laughs> Thank you. Ow. Ow. God. I don't bonk the entire time that I bonked twice in the same spot. Hell yeah. Bombs now. Okay. If I remember correctly, now you just grab this. They locked onto her. The fairy will. Go around you and then go to grandma. There we go. We saved the grandma. And see again. Oh, chat! Is that you, chat? Grandma's always happy with your bright, shining face. Chat, my dears. Chat! You're safe. That's wonderful. Just wonderful. You do this, you heal me. Oh, you're such a sweet child. Oh, that's right. You and your sister, Ariel, are trying so hard to be strong, and I've just been sitting here moaning and worrying. I'm your grandmother, the one who should be taking care of you. I'm oh, sorry, chat. I haven't even considered what you must be going through. I'm a terrible grandma. Chat, this is all I have to give you right now. You can keep it in your empty bottle. Soup! I got elixir soup. It replenishes all of your life energy and magic power, and your attack power also doubles until the first time you take damage. Well, that is one hearty soup. And. There's two helpings inside. Oh. You and your sister love this soup, don't you? You run out, I can make it for you anytime you like. Grandma's gonna try to be strong, so you try to be strong too. Don't do anything reckless, all right? Oh, whoopsie. Language I do not understand. Well met indeed, Jaboon. I'm pleased to see that you are safe. Language I do not understand. Yes, it seems Gan has returned. There can be no other explanation. Blah 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 blah. Unfortunately, that is not so. Blah 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 blah. What I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. And yet I sense great promise in the courage that this one possesses. Blah 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 blah. Up 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 up. Deal. It's the only way. Jabu and Jaboon. Jabun, whatever. Yippee! You got Nairu's Pearl! The water spirit Jaboon was kind enough to give you this jewel, a treasure of one of the goddesses. 